I'm grateful for Innovate We Can because we've been able to work alongside some amazing partners in creating community goals that will have lasting and impactful changes for our children with special needs. I am grateful for Any Baby Can because they have given me the opportunity to provide classes that focus on the physical and mental health of our families. I am grateful for Any Baby Can because we have the incredible opportunity to be able to partner with families to share information, resources, and support for their child. I am grateful for Any Baby Can because we can provide free or low cost medications to uninsured and underinsured residents in our community. I'm grateful for Any Baby Can because we serve with our hearts. I am grateful for Any Baby Can because we do not have an income guideline for families to receive case management services. I'm grateful for Any Baby Can because we're able to improve the quality of life for our families. I'm grateful for Any Baby Can because they give me the opportunity to share our family's stories and to spread the word of the work we do for the community. I am grateful for Any Baby Can because we have the most generous, compassionate, kind-hearted supporters and donors that believe in us, our mission, our families, and children. I am grateful to Any Baby Can because we continue to serve our families in non-traditional ways, despite the current circumstances, to ensure that their needs are met and they feel supported. I just love that grateful video, right? I love seeing our staff really talking about why they love Any Baby Can and why they're grateful. And really, that's why we're here today, right? To show gratitude. Yes, every time I watch that video, it just makes me cry because it's genuinely what we feel. It's who we are and it's, it's what we do. So we are very, very grateful. Yeah, so my name is Hugo. I'm currently the CEO of Any Baby Can. I'm Veronica, your Chief Development Officer. And we just want to thank you all for joining us tonight. Thank you all for being a part of this journey this whole month with us. We're so excited to be here now live, right, yes. in front of everybody. We made it. We're here <laughs> for the Angels for Hope finale, and we're so excited that you're here with us. Thank you for tuning in. We know that you guys are still logging in, but continue to join us. We have a lot of exciting news and events to share with you this evening. That's right. So this evening would have been the Angel Affair. It would have been our third annual Angel Affair at the Tobin Center, right? Yes. So that's why we're wearing white. So hopefully some of you watching tonight are wearing white as well. But we would have been at the Tobin Center celebrating Any Baby Can, celebrating the angels in our community. But we wanted to do that here tonight, yes. live with you all, because we would have raised $250,000 at the event tonight. We don't think we'll get there to 250 tonight, but we wanted to raise as much money as we can for our families. Yes. yes. And so why Angels for Hope? Angels for Hope came about because, as Hugo mentioned, we would have had the Angel Affair this evening, raising $250,000. But because we've seen an increase of 251%, yeah. yes, guys, you guys heard me right, 251% yeah. of the crisis needs for our families. So we, we're fighting harder, we're, we're staying strong, and so we have to continue to raise money for our children. We, Amy Baby Can serves families raising children. Uh, with disabilities or yes. special needs. And so that's what we're doing. And we have seen a decrease of 52% in the events for the fundraising efforts. So that's why we're here tonight. Yes, definitely. And really why I'm here, you know, I've been with Any Baby Can almost 20 years. Mm -hmm. And I started in a clinic years ago, right, with families who were sitting there receiving the diagnosis of autism for their children. So I was there. I was able to put my hand on their shoulder, mm -hmm. say, it'll be okay. I know it's shocking. Um, so I would meet with the families, go to their homes, talk to them about our services, but they would tell me that they felt like they were grieving, like they'd mm -hmm. lost the child that they had. Because right as a parent, you have a child you dream about graduating high school, graduating college, getting married, grandchildren. So all those dreams, they, these parents told me, were out the window now mm -hmm. that this diagnosis happened. So what I like to say that, that I did years ago, and I continue pushing today, that Any Baby Can does, is we give new dreams and new hopes for those families. Because everyone can have success, regardless of what the, the diagnosis is. So that's what excites me about Any Baby Can. Yes, and we have a family that I had the honor to meet recently. I was at the office preparing for Angels for Hope, mm -hmm. and you know, I've got to, to meet a mom, and what, you, what an honor it was for me to meet her. Her name is Melissa. 
she came to Any Baby Can uh, because of her son, Kirk, and yes. called us. And we returned her call. We couldn't get a hold of her. But we <laughs> right. said, we don't give up. We don't stop calling. And so we kept calling. We kept calling Melissa. And finally, we got a hold of her. And she said, you know what, guys? Thank yeah. you for continuing to keep calling me. Thank you for not giving up on me. And yes. as a tear streamed down her face, and I look in the back of her car, she has this beautiful blonde hair, <laughs> little boy named Kirk. His smile lights up any room. He brought me so much joy with just that smile, and I witnessed her, his mom with the tears coming down her face of gratitude and just saying, I finally do not feel isolated mm. anymore. I feel like I'm a part of a family, and that's who we are. That's yes. what any baby can is, and that's what we do. I love that you always describe it as we give a hug, yes. right? We give a hug to that family member. Now they're not alone, right? So our yeah. services, hopefully you all are watching, right? You know what MABC Can does, but we provide case management services. So that's connecting people to the resources we have in-house, but also in the community and throughout the state, right? We do autism services programs. So that's educating families when they have the child diagnosed with autism, really building that foundation, building uh, lots of training for, for families as they move forward. We do community training, first responder training through that program. So lots of great education. And we are any baby can, right? So yes. people get a little confused sometimes, but we do have a prescription assistance program, right? So that's anyone in the community, regardless of what age, right? That are in, uninsured or underinsured that can access medications through our pharmaceutical companies, right? right? So that's really a cool thing. Lots of people access that service. And Hugo means any age. So that's, that's adults, right. that's seniors. So we are here to be available to help you guys in that manner as yeah, well. Yeah, definitely. We also have a health and wellness program. So we focus on nutrition, health, the seven dimensions of wellness, right? Exercise, we do camps as well. So that's a really fun program that we do. And unfortunately, sometimes our children do pass away, right? So um, we have a center for infant and child loss that really helps families pay for funerals, uh, bereavement services, and we connect them to all the great people in the community as well to get those services and really have a dignified burial for their children, right? right. So we want to definitely do that. Yes. And the am amazing thing about our, our agency is that it started back in 1982 by Dr. Marion Sokol. Fast forward 30 years later, yeah. and we have all of these resources and, and departments available um, for you and your family. And the amazing thing on top of all of that is that we don't charge the family. So right. imagine the stress levels that already come with receiving a diagnosis and being unsure of what to do next. Yeah. Any baby can comes in. We are that hug, right? Mm -hmm. And we do it at no cost. There's also no waiting list. So when you give us a call, we're going to help you right on the spot. We're going to be able to help you and provide you tools and resources. And there's no income level requirements that we, That's right. that we have at all. Yeah. So if you don't remember any of that that we just <laughs> talked about, all of our services, just think, if you know someone or if you have someone in your family that has a special need, call any baby can. We will connect you to the right people. If we don't have the services in-house, we'll connect you to the right people. So please give us a call if you need some help or if you know someone that needs some help. Just We want to. We also want to acknowledge our employees. Our Any oh Baby gosh. Can employees are just phenomenal uh, individuals that have the biggest hearts because they serve with their hearts. And everything we do, we do because we, do, we want to be here to serve yes. our families. So even in this crisis that we've been experiencing, right? We can't see our children face to face yeah. as we used to and the occupational therapy or the physical therapy that they would receive. We're doing everything virtual. We are working from home. We're doing it on the phone. Yes. You know, we're doing doorstep drop offs. So our services have not stopped. You know, this, if anything, we are fighting harder for yes. our families because, you know, think about it. They're not able to go into the stores. Their immune systems may be already compromised. Mm -hmm. They can't go see the doctor in person. So that re that also brings in stress. Oh, my God, totally, yeah. There's so much isolation that comes with having a child diagnosed with a special need. Depending on what the diagnosis is, right, there's more isolation. But even so much more now. Like, we are all feeling isolated. So imagine these families, mm -hmm. right? So you mentioned stress, right? Yes. So we have a parent stress class that we help parents understand really what's causing the stress and what can you do to help reduce that stress. Because we know that stress increases the possibility of child abuse right. and family violence. So all of our services are working to reduce all of that, to make sure exactly. that our ki kids stay safe and there's a great foundation and our families can move forward. So we're, we're very yes. excited to be able to do that for our community. Yep. Yeah. So now, yes. do we want to get into some of the other cool stuff that I we've had so. going on this month, for right? Sure. So we've had an auction. Right, so we were so excited to have these great auction items, and so now we're going to announce who our winners are, right, for our auction. Yes, we are. So the first one is our Amos Lee signed premium acoustic Fender guitar. Ooh, so look how cool this beauty. is. 
There's Amos Lee's signature. And so the person who won this auction item is Thomas Chandler. So thank you so much to Thomas Chandler. And congratulations, Mr. Chandler. That's this right. This is now you rightfully yours. We can't wait to hear you play it. Yes, we can. You have to send us a picture or video, yes. okay? Yes. Congratulations. Congratulations. So the next prize we have is the 2007 signed official San Antonio Spurs <laughs> NBA championship plaque. This is the BB that. that I just announced here. And Very the winner cool. for this one is Thomas Chandler. Thomas Chandler. You are amazing. Thank you, Thomas. <laughs> and congratulations. Take a picture of this, too. I want to know Two things. before you hang it. That's okay. right. Thank you so much, Thomas. Thomas. So our third item is the Tapatio Springs La Cantera Hill Country Getaway, right? Oh, yes. So we've got, you know, some pictures here. I think everybody's familiar with La Cantera and oh, Tapatio yes. Springs. So sure. this is a cool thing. And the winner of this auction item, I think we both know, oh, we right? Do. Lovely, <laughs> lovely lady. Yes, Christina Martinez. Thank you so much and congratulations. Thank you, Christina. If you want us to come along with you, we will. Give us a call. I will totally go. <laughs> and our fourth auction item, we have the South Padre Island Oasis wow. at the gorgeous Sant Fire Hotel. Yes. And I believe it's like the 28th floor. So imagine wow. the views there. And we both know this beautiful lady as we well. We do very and much. Her name and the winner is Susie Guillen Gonzalez. Wow, Susie, congratulations. Congratulations, Susie. We appreciate you. Thank you so much. All right. So thank you all for participating in the auction. Lots of fun things given away. And like Veronica mentioned, we are available yes. to go to any of these things, Susie, right? if you want us to go to the beach. <laughs> Definitely. <laughs> so now let's talk about the giveaways that we have, right? Yeah, so another option we had for you is for every $500 that was donated, we're going to enter your name into a beautiful gold we have right here on the side. We have your name in uh, to pull your name from there. And so it, we, everyone who gave $500, yes. your name is in there. So if you gave 2000 times right that's right so and we, we had can, lots and lots of people we did so that thank you. Uh, we I, entered i felt like this was a great uh incentive people yeah. really love this yeah. and said i want to be entered to win these these giveaway prizes yes so, so it's, it's great to give from your heart right but if you can get something in return right why not do it right we love doing that so All chrissy's right. off to the side right here she's pulling names for the first drawing which will be the Port O'Connor Bay private fishing trip. So we got a little picture here. So let's see who gets this prize. Veronica, I'll let you okay. read the name of our winner. Debbie Ekmar. What? Congratulations. Abby and David Ekmar. Look at you guys. You're going to go on a fishing trip. This is a private trip. That's this right. This is very private. So very congratulations. Very cool. Congratulations. The next one we have is our 2007-2008 Team Sign Official San Antonio Spurs NBA plaque. <laughs> I'll hold it okay, so we don't great. drop it and you can read the okay. name there. And that winner is uh, Mr. Rick Bird. Rick Bird, awesome. Congratulations, Rick. We appreciate your support. That's right. Longtime supporter of Any yes. Baby Can. Let's put that okay. there with a the name. So I'm next, right? So... The next thing that we're giving away is a gorgeous white and gold Gresh guitar. Now, this is, like, I don't play in musical instruments or guitars, right? But look how beautiful this is. I'm a little Absolutely scared to, to hold it, I but know. it's beautiful. And if you guys take notice here, we've got a beautiful uh, eagles on there. Eagle That's right. Wing, angel wing. And so it matches the, it the event, right? So let's see outfits. who wins this. I, I'm holding it so okay. that way. And that one is Miss Barbara Gentry. Oh, wow, Barbara, thank Yay, you so much. Barbara, Again, a longtime supporter of Any Baby Can. And all righty, congratulations. Awesome, awesome. And we have one final prize to give away for that drawing, and that is a private uh, wine event at Total Wine. Ooh, this one I definitely want to be invited to, this for is sure. Total Wine and More. And all right. And for that one is... Is it my name? I don't yeah. know. Chrissy gave me a weird face. <laughs> Ooh, it's Ramon Hernandez. <laughs> Congratulations, oh my God. Ramon. Thank you. I'm glad we have four witnesses in the room <laughs> that, that are watching yes. this. And he wanted to go. You see how 
I know. I spoke it. Now you have it. I, I made it. Congratulations. I, I made it happen. Well, brought that's it. if he wants to share it that's, with you. He may not That's true. He may take you all. I don't know, right? <laughs> oh, my God. But thank you so much. That was so much fun, that right? I, I think that's incredible. And again, giveaways. thank you all for, for donating and giving and, and being able to do this for you all. So much fun. Yes. So thank you. So congratulations to our auction winners and our $500 recipients and all these that's wonderful right. prizes. And so now we move into, uh, it all started with a Zoom call. We love yes. this story, right? So Hugo and I had a Zoom call with an amazing lady that supports the community. There's so many out there. But one particular that we're talking about now uh, is our Community First Health Plans. That's right. So let's take a couple minutes here and watch this video from them. Uh, so we'll, we'll do that and we'll talk a little bit more afterwards. A healthy community means a happy and vibrant community. That is why Community First Health Plans is here to provide the health coverage our families need to thrive. As the only local nonprofit health plan in Bayer and surrounding counties, our goal is that all families, children with special needs, and expectant mothers have access to affordable health care. Together, we can keep our families healthy. Together, we are a community with a plan. Community First Health Plans. What an amazing video. And yeah. thank you so much again to Community First Health Plans for supporting Any Baby Can. You've been a longtime supporter for so many years, and they contributed $10,000 right. to Any Baby Can. Which yeah. Is so amazing. Cynthia de la Pena. Yes. We are so grateful for you and your team for and your like, love yeah. and support. Veronica said, longtime supporters, right? So, you know, she's been around and she said we would help. And so we knew that they would come in to help mm -hmm. us and support this. This event, but we were just so overwhelmed, full of gratitude when she said, yes. we're going to give you $10,000, right? Our so, hearts exploded that day. I mean, both... Uh, that was our first donation, too, was. right? And it was even before the, this whole campaign started. Yes, so, yeah. and our faces were super red out of excitement because it was just... What a, what a wonderful call to get that yeah. call and to say that we're getting that type yeah. of support. So thank we you did again. Cry. We did cry a little bit. And we also want to just acknowledge DJ Act 6, oh, right? Yes. Who is Cynthia's son. He's been at the Walk for Autism. He's a, a youth DJ, right? Yes. He's incredible. Um, so, and he also has a song out right now. So, you know, iTunes or any of the streaming platforms, right? You can go and download his song. So look for DJ Act 6. Depending on the ones and twos, look That's them up. Right. He's available to be booked for parties as well. <laughs> That's right, booking for a party. Yes. We should have brought him here tonight. We could have had, had some music side. and dancing. Okay. Uh, and then I just <laughs> want to say we did have another $10,000 donor who, who asked to remain anonymous. So thank you to, to you as yes. well. You know who you are. Thank you so much. We appreciate you guys. All right. So now we just want to say thank you, right, to some other folks that gave. So Community Health, once again, we thank you for your support. Any baby can. Uh, we also want to thank our oops. Hope Angel. This is our Hope Angel level. So Debbie Eckmark. So this is Abby and David Eckmark, right? Dr. Eckmark, thank yes, you so much. Thank you. We also have Catherine Labatt. Thank you so much for being our Hope Angel. We're so grateful for you. You've been a longtime supporter yes. of Any Baby Can as well, and so we're so thankful. And the last one we want to thank is another longtime oh, supporter of Any Baby Can. Amazing. Just an incredible person. An amazing man. Craig Donegan. Thank you so much, Craig. You are phenomenal. Yes, thank you. Thank you so much. Yes. All right, so now we'll go into thanking a few more people, right? Yes. Um, so this is at our Star Angel level. We want to thank Living Faith Community Church, Catherine Labatt, who we mentioned there. Obviously, HEB, right? Yes. They are incredible, always uh, supporting and, and helping here, yes. right? Helping so thank you to HEB. <laughs> <laughs> thank you to Amogee Bank. We're so yes. grateful for your support. Rick Bird, thank you again. And we also have Generations Federal Credit Union. Thank you right. for your support. Thank you. So now at our helper angel level, we have Random Acts. Uh, Neiman Marcus, oh, right? Yes, of course. We, we love Neiman Marcus. And someone else we love, Luxury Home Magazine. Oh, love Christina Thank you. And Tomas. That's Thank right. You, Luxury Home Magazine. Well, we love everybody, right? We so do. I could just keep saying I love all these people, but Alamo Outdoor Signs, Caillou Foundation, Coldwell Banker Deanne Harper Realtors. Yes. Deanne, again, another longtime supporter, maybe we can. You. Matthew Lawrence, Barbara, Barbara Gentry, uh, Elaine Malone. And Sandra and George Salinas, thank you all. We also want to give a thank you for our helper angel, helper angels to Pallavi Namani. Thank you, Pallavi. Mm -hmm. Julie Henderson, Susan K. Dragon, Frost Bank, 
Texas Home Loans, Dr. Frank Moorhead, Louis Labatt, thank mm-hmm. you, Red McCombs, yes. Toyota, Stacy Thibodeau, Kim Jeffries. Who I think is watching. I, I was told Kim, Kim was watching, so Julie's thank you for watching. Too. Julie's there too, yeah, right? So thank you guys. We have Children's Hospital of San Antonio and Mr. Ramon Hernandez. That's right. So we've got Julie, we've got Kim watching, Stacy Thibodeau, Jeannie Hartman, oh, Mario Jean. Bowman. So thank you all for watching. Hi, everyone. Hi, everybody. Uh, so I'll finish off the list of, of Chair of Angels, right? So we've got Matt and Karen Conrad, Marley Kutzer, Barbara Keys. The Emmett G. Donegan Foundation, John and Louise Scan- Scanlon, Laura Cabaretta, Bill Miller Barbecue, mm, and Siglali Herrera Salazar. So thank you all for, for donating. Also, Chair of Angels, we have Mayu Brew, mm-hmm. Christ Episcopal Church, Elise Bernal, Carol Pavon Milan, Craig Stanich. Thank you so much to our Chair of Angels. Yeah, thank you all so much. That's incredible. Thank you for giving. Uh, Another group of people that we need to thank is the Angel Affair Committee. Uh, Just incredible group of people that have helped us with the Angel Affair, right? They would have been uh, at the Tobin with us tonight, but they've been incredible helping us. So thank you to all of you, and many of them are are watching right now. Yes, you guys are amazing. Thank you for all your help, your suggestions, your input. Because of all of that, here we are tonight uh, having a good time expressing our our, our gratitude to everyone. And then, obviously, the board of directors, right? Oh we can't goodness. go without thanking any Baby Cans board of directors for supporting all of this that we're doing tonight, right? Mm-hmm. When we talk about our board of directors, I think about passion. Yes. I think about love and commitment. You know, our board of directors have full-time positions that they take care of families or that they have as well, but they have it out of their hearts to serve at any Baby Can to ensure that our families are receiving the help in the manner of which we serve. So thank you to our board of directors for yes. all your love, your passion, your dedication, and your support. Yeah, we couldn't do this without no, them, right? Thank so you. we could sit here for three hours thanking yes. people uh, by name, but we're, we are going to thank some people by name because, again, they have just been longtime supporters and, and really helping us with a lot of the things that happened here tonight. Yes. So the first person I want to thank, or that we want to thank, right, is Julie Henderson. Yes. Uh, has supported Any Baby Can for years. Uh, she and her family have supported us. And a lot of the things that you see here tonight, right, yes. some of these auction items and giveaways, uh, Julie helped us to bring those in. So we, we love Julie. We have so much gratitude for Julie. So thank you so much for supporting us. Thank you, Julie. We did have the $1,000 doorstep drop-off donation mm-hmm. bags. And so there are some uh, individuals that we want to thank that made it possible to make those bags so yummy. Yes. And one of those <laughs> is Miss Kim Riojas. Yes. The rum cakes just melt oh in your gosh. mouth. You do not want it's a shareable uh, portion that was given, but you don't want to share, share those. No. You just want to eat the whole thing. They're yeah. so delicious. <laughs> so thank you, Kim. Yes, thank you, Kim. We also want to thank uh, Randall Stevenson. He's the AT and T executive chairman, right? So again, a friend of Julie Henderson's, uh, but he donated some of the plaques and, and the guitar that you see here tonight. So thank you to to Randall, who's been to the Angel Affair and has been an incredible supporter. Yes, we also want to thank for some more deliciousness, a cookie extraordinaire in your bag if you donated a thousand. You also got these delicious chocolate chip cookies with a sprinkle of sea salt that yes. just also melt in your mouth. And I probably gained about three to four pounds <laughs> because I ordered a whole dozen. Uh, Ramon Hernandez, thank you so much for those delicious treats. Yes, thank you. Uh, Jeannie Hartman, thank you so much for the Tapatio Springs package. Mm-hmm. Again, a member of our committee who's helped us with so many things throughout the years. So thank you to Jeannie. And Marley Kutzer, thank you so much, yes. Marley, for the Port O'Connor fishing trip, donating that, helped me also with the Cobalt Banker meetings and mm-hmm. calls. You have been also, uh, phenomenal for helping out with that as well. Yeah, definitely. We want to thank Awilda Ronimus, oh, right, from yes. Tiffany & Company. Incredible person, beautiful person inside and out. She helped us with the South Padre Island package to Sapphire Hotel. So, again, uh, Tiffany & Company has been involved with the Angel mm-hmm. Affair, and Awilda has been involved. So thank you to Awilda for helping us with that. Yes, and there's another uh, company that we want to give. You see these beautiful earrings Ooh, yes. that I have on? This is Hermana Craft Company. These also came in your bag if you were $1,000 and over. This is available on Etsy. Mm-hmm. Uh, they're artisan earrings that are handcrafted. So thank you to Hermana Craft Company. Uh, look them up on Etsy and order your pair yeah. today. I love their logo, right? Yes. So cool. Uh, we want to thank uh, Patricia Butler from Coffee Sionado, mm-hmm. right? So some of you received coffee in your bags that you found at your doorstep. 
she donated all that coffee to us, which Thank is incredible, you, right? Yummy. Thank you, Patricia. She has an incredible store uh, that you should go visit. So Coffee Sionado, right? From Colombia. From Colombia, right? Yes. Uh, and then we want to have a special thank you. Well, I also want to thank you. I know oh, that yes. yes, when you... When I'm you, getting ahead of myself. Sorry. <laughs> <It's okay>. Just <laughs> talking over you. Uh, we also have, you heard as we logged in, there's a beautiful music that was played at the beginning. If not, you're going to hear it at the end. Yes. And you'll continue to hear it as well because we had custom production music done just for Any Baby Can for mm -hmm. the Angel Affair, but also for Angels for Hope. And that is by Josh Cavazos. Yes, incredible, talented person, yes, he is. super kind. Again, Julie Henderson yes. introduced us to him. So thank you, Josh. It's, it's an incredible piece of music, and we're so thrilled to have that. Um, so now I, I go, yes. right? Now I can thank. I was just so excited, <laughs> right, to thank this next person. I want to thank Ciclali Herrera Salazar, right? She's with X, uh, X Level Inc., and she was going to be our chair person for the Angel Affair this year. So it didn't happen, right? The event didn't happen, we all know, but she said, I still want to help. Yes. I still want to be a part of this. So she's been an incredible uh, supporter, someone who's really been pushing this event, pushing for her friends and everyone in the community to donate. So, uh, I mean, I could go on and on about Siklali. Yes. There's so many things that she has done. So again, Siklali, thank you so much for, for being a part of our, our lives, part of Any Baby Can, and helping us with this event. So thank you. Thank you, Siklali. We're so grateful for you. Okay. Now, ready? little surprise giveaway, yes, right? Yes, we do. So before we announce our grand total, we have a surprise. We So we're speaking of Siklali. She actually said, I have a special treat that I'd like to give to any baby can to continue the fundraising effort through the end of the month. So we're going to continue these to right. August 31st. And so anybody who gives from on, you can do it right now as we're talking mm -hmm. throughout the end of the month. We're going to put your name in a drawing. There is a beautiful three-piece butterfly effect Fior collection set. It's a ring, a bracelet, and earrings. We're going to post the pictures online. We're going to post the yep. link. Um, also, if you desire to shop, ladies um, or men, if you want to get us something for your wives, beautiful, right? yes, for your for your beautiful lady, please go on and shop at that link. We'll be posting that later this evening. So yes, if you continue to get or anybody anybody who That's gives, right. if you already won, you already it's for anyone, any amount, any amount. That's right. And we're gonna put your name in the drawing for this beautiful collection. Yes. So we have a little breaking news, Veronica. We've got numbers written for our grand total on our cards, but that's not correct anymore. Oh, my goodness. So we do have a new grand total. How exciting. <laughs> so I'll let Veronica read our grand total for what we've raised in the month of August for the Angels for Hope campaign. So let me see if I could do this without getting emotional because I am an emotional one being, but it's because of my heart and what we do and how we serve. So it's an honor for me to announce the grand total of where we are. As I mentioned, you guys saw Hugo and I's videos that we were. Yep. our goal was – Fifty thousand dollars. Fifty thousand. We thought fifty thousand will be good. Right, and we we, been, we would have raised two hundred fifty thousand <laughs> tonight, but you know, we figured let's start start with fifty thousand. Yes. It's our first time doing this sort of event. So grand total. Ready? Oh my gosh, ready? We we okay, needed like drum like roll or drum confetti roll, or confetti something or popper, but here we are: ninety three thousand four hundred thirty four dollars and forty three cents. That's right. Oh my gosh, ninety three thousand dollars. $434.43. So thank you oh. to you all. Oh, my God. That's just an incredible amount. And so our internal goal, right, was 100000 yes. So we've got a few more days to raise another $7,000. And so it's very easy to, to text, right? Yes. You can give over your phone. Super easy. You can text the word HOPE to the number 830-444-4146. This is not for a lawyer. I know those numbers sound familiar. 444. Yes. Don't, yeah. don't think about him or that. Think about us. Any baby can. Once again, text the word HOPE to 830-444-4146. <laughs> You've been dying to <laughs> dance cool. all night. I, I know. I some music. All right. I want to dance. So really, now we've come to the end of yes. tonight. So we really, again, we started with gratitude, and we want to end with gratitude. Uh, it has just been an incredible experience this whole month. We've talked to so many people. We've yes. reached out to so many people. And we were a little concerned, right, during this time of COVID, right? You know, it's kind of awkward to be asking people yes. for support. Very, yes. But we've talked about how much support our families need. So it's just been an incredible outpouring that we've seen from our community. Uh, so we just want to say thank you from the bottom of our hearts. We yes. love you all for giving and being a part of our family, being a part of Any Baby Can's family. 
Yes, we say thank you. We say muchas gracias. We say shalom, which means peace. And right now, Hugo and I send that peace out to you guys. We send love to you virtually. We wish we could be together and give everyone a hug and yes. be, you know, be able to embrace that way. And we will soon. So I just want to say let's stay, continue to stay strong together yes. because we are going to get through this, everyone. And so we just want to say thank you again. Muchos, muchos gracias. That's right. You're bilingual <laughs> now. So here we want to just toast you all for, again, making this uh, a success for any baby can and really for our families because all that we do we are mission driven everything we do is for our families and our children so yes. thank you thank you so much cheers. cheers have a wonderful evening thank you so much for joining us we're so grateful take care